If we have a chance to choose 11 players from those who rejected Liverpool, that team could easily win any trophy in the world. Without waiting any longer, let's find out why these players didn't choose Liverpool and what made them decide. Starting with the latest. Things were looking great when Liverpool offered a massive £110 million for Moises Casido from Brighton. Brighton said yes to the deal, but then someone spoiled the party. Casido himself surprised everyone by saying a big no, adding that no matter what, he wants to join the London Blues Chelsea. Well, that's awkward for Jurgen Klopp's team. But you know what? Liverpool might be used to these turndowns because, back in the day, even the youngest player since Pele to score in a World Cup final, Kylian Mbappe, said no to them, not once, but twice. First in 2017 when he was with Monaco, and then last summer in 2022. The Frenchman, who was almost at the end of his contract in June 2022, thought about changing his surroundings, but in the end, he stayed in Paris. Even though Kylian Mbappe's mum likes Liverpool a lot, he revealed that for him, it was a choice between PSG and Real Madrid. Speaking of Madrid, Liverpool faced some tough luck with someone from the Bernabeu too. When Jude Bellingham chose Madrid, Klopp probably thought he had a shot at getting Federico Valverde. It makes sense given Liverpool's need to strengthen their midfield, especially after Henderson and Fabinho surprisingly went to Saudi Arabia. Valverde said no thanks to Liverpool's offer and decided to stick around in Spain. There are rumours that Liverpool might want to pay around £60 million to get him, but as of now, Valverde doesn't seem to have any plans to move. Not too long ago, another midfielder from Madrid was a player Liverpool was interested in. Aurelien Chouameni was on their radar last summer. PSG, Liverpool and Madrid were all competing to sign him. Klopp even had a face-to-face -face talk with him to try and convince him to join. But unfortunately, Chouameni turned down Klopp and Liverpool's offer, preferring Madrid instead. Here's another instance where Klopp tried his luck. During his earlier days, he was eyeing Dembele. Klopp actually had a meeting with Dembele in Paris, hoping to bring him to Liverpool. However, he missed the boat because Dembele had already decided on joining Borussia Dortmund. He believed that this move would be better for his young career. So, off to Dortmund he went, and just a year later, he made a huge leap to Barcelona for a whopping 105 million euros. Moreover, here's another story that might be tough for Liverpool fans to swallow. Even Cristiano Ronaldo wasn't interested in showcasing his tricks for Liverpool. During his early days at Sporting Lisbon, the Portuguese winger dazzled with his skills. In 2003, when Gerard Houllier was managing the Reds, he spotted Ronaldo's potential. Houllier was determined to bring him to Anfield, but the stars didn't align. Ronaldo asked for a hefty salary which didn't match Liverpool's strict transfer budget policy. As a result, CR7's journey led him to Manchester United instead. Elsewhere, there was a time when Christian Pulisic was also targeted by Liverpool. The Reds' £11 million offer was turned down in the summer of 2016 but their interest carried into the January transfer window. While they were preparing another bid to entice Pulisic to Anfield, he solidified his commitment to Dortmund by signing a new contract. He explained that Dortmund had provided him with everything he needed, and he held a genuine affection for the club. Talking of more rejections, German World Cup champion Tony Cruz was an unexpected target for Liverpool back in 2014. During the summer, when he was a central midfielder at Bayern Munich, the opportunity for transfer arose. Liverpool, with Brendan Rodgers as their manager back then, entered the scene. Rodgers requested his captain, Steven Gerrard, to talk to Cruz. Unfortunately, despite their efforts, Cruz opted for Madrid over Liverpool, leaving them with empty hands. But did you know that Liverpool once tried to outbid Alexi Sanchez? The Chilean player was no longer needed at Barcelona and caught the interest of the Reds, who aimed to sign him in 2014. Unfortunately, the plan didn't work out as he decided to join Arsenal instead. Initially, it was believed that he chose Arsenal because he preferred living in the capital rather than Liverpool. However, the real reason turned out to be quite surprising. Sanchez later revealed that he picked Arsenal over Liverpool because he believed the Gunners had greater ambition and a stronger ability to compete in various tournaments. 
Finally, in the case of Memphis Depay, the Dutch striker used to be a rising star who caught the attention of numerous top clubs, Liverpool included. PSV Eindhoven's technical director, Marcel Brand, noted that Liverpool got in touch and had discussions with Depay. However, in the end, Memphis himself made the crucial choice. He decided to go with Manchester United, believing he could achieve more at the Theatre of Dreams. Perhaps Liverpool might be secretly chuckling and relieved now, seeing how Depay's journey unfolded at United. So there you have it, the legendary list. If you're a Liverpool fan, we understand your feelings, but take comfort in the fact that you've still welcomed some incredible players throughout the years. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so that you never miss out on new content. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye!